guys? I'm here with my friend Ryan Liu. He's gonna show us his collection. How you doing, Ryan? How are you, sir? Good, good. I came to Ryan's house maybe like what, about a month ago to pick up a statue for a friend. And when I came through this door and I saw his collection, I almost like my jaw dropped. He has literally a hundred statues in this room. Believe it or not, a hundred. And I didn't believe it at first. But he's like, no, count it. And when we count it, it was a hundred statues. I mean, I don't know if I can even own that much statues. <laughs> so, Ryan, tell us, how long have you been collecting? Uh, two and a half years. Two and a half years and a yeah. hundred statues. That's just 50 statues a year. Well, 50 yeah. statues times 300, that's around 15,000 a year. Well, I didn't get married before, so it's fine. <laughs> oh my god, man. You're lucky. I mean, you have some amazing pieces and you have some grails. I mean, we're going to show you the at all. But tell me, like, how? why did you start collecting? What was the first thing that you saw that made you collect? Okay, I went to the SDCC 2010. To where? 2010 SDCC. Oh, SDC. okay. Yes. And then I just saw some of these. I was shocked. Wow. You know, by then. And I saw this guy there. I was like, wow. Oh, Twelve hundred yeah. dollars. No, at that time it was a lot Too of money. Yeah. yeah, I was like two hundred for statues. Yeah. No way. Oh. But then I just I go home. I just I pre-order right away and then start collecting these. But what was the first statue you bought? The first one is the the turtle. Oh, Michael. Yeah. Michael Angelo. Yeah, Michael Angelo. Yeah. Michael Angelo. Yeah. Okay, and I mean. Is that like, did, why did you buy Michelangelo the first? Is that like something you wanted since you were a kid or mm -hmm. because you, you were raised on t Ninja Turtles? Like, yeah, okay, yeah. Like, so am I. Like, they're, I wish, I regret not getting them all and I, I know for a fact that one day I will, yep. but they're so expensive right now. Oh, so yeah. I have to like take a step back and focus on other yes. things. But okay, I see you have almost everything. Which one is your favorite statue? Now, yeah. it's, it's going to be the wolf. Of course it's a wolf, yeah. you just got it! Yeah. But deep down inside, before the wolf, which one was your best statue? Uh, I would say this guy right here. Optimus Prime. Yes. Are you a fan of Optimus, uh, like the Transformer? Yeah, yeah I love the, those, well, I watch coming before, you know. Yeah, and okay. the movies, wow. Well, you know, yeah. I want to ask you, I know you're married and you have a gorgeous baby. By the way, beautiful daughter, beautiful. Thank you. But let me ask you a question, which one does your wife like the most? My wife, this guy too. This guy too? Yeah. So she'll tell you to sell everything but keep this guy. Yeah. Well, she's she has a good taste because this is like a work of art. Yeah. I mean, so much detail and everything. Uh, how? I mean, you're lucky. Um, my girlfriend gets mad when I buy a statue. You have a very, you're lucky to have a wife that lets you have this room for it. It's, it's amazing. Okay. Now, I've seen you have almost everything, again. But is there a statue that you don't have that you want to buy? The first thing on my mind will be the Ra Ryu. Yes. Actually, you're right. You don't have it. Yeah. <laughs> Are you waiting for Jerry to make the new one, or what is it? Yes, possible, but I'm not sure if he's gonna make a new one yet. But I see you have Shinakuma. Yeah. You know, if you want, I'll I'll find a white Ryu for you. <laughs> you <give me> Shin. <laughs> you know, the the first thing I collect Street Fighter because I got a Shin. Otherwise, I won't get this line. You know? Oh, I see. Yeah, that's the hardest one to get. How much you paid for that shit? Uh, about fifteen. Fifteen hundred. Yeah. That it's, it's it's nice. It's yeah. nice. But I mean, that's a lot for for a shin. I mean, yeah. I now they go like for like twenty five, if not more. Yeah, I know. It's, it's crazy. Shit is sick. But okay, let me ask you another question. You don't, you barely have any more room left. Mm -hmm. I see you have one here empty. And you have maybe on top a little bit empty, but that's about it. Everything else is packed. Yeah. Where are you going to put your new orders? That's the first question on my mind too. First of all, before you answer, how many orders do you, do you have right now? What, what do you have ordered from Sideshow or other companies? Do you have... Now, I only have like 10 pre-order. Only Sideshow. 10? Only 10, yes. That's what you call sick in the head. <laughs> come closer, come closer. That's what you call sick in the head. He only has 10. Don't worry, I'm in the same boat as you. See? So what do you have? You have DC, I'm guessing. Well, whatever you have, I have. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See? See? So you have DC, you have Sagat, mm -hmm. you have... Yeah. What else do you have? Probably Deadpool. Tell me you have Deadpool. Yeah, I got that. Of course, of course. you have Deadpool. Yes. So where are you going to put all those? I mean, I, you, I don't think you have space for 10 statues. <laughs> I mean, you can squeeze them. Are you going to sell the line or something? Yeah, I need to sell something to make the room. What would, what would you sell first? I had to get rid of some lines, so 
Baby doll the lines. Oh, the baby doll the lines. Yeah. Wow, and you know these like if you sell them all, you'll make good money because I know how much does this one go for? Like a thousand or something? Eight hundred, nine hundred? Probably seven, eight. Yeah. I mean, they're very detailed. They're, they're oh, not looking amazing. Well, I love them. Man. It's very good. But you still will sell. But I need to get rid of something to put in. How about these? Uh, you know, I'll take Shen from you. This will be the last one. <laughs> I'll take Shen from you. That's the second last. <laughs> well, you know what? I don't blame you. And I see you have this bad boy right here too. Yeah. You just have like all the amazing statues. Um, I can't see anything. You even have Darth Stalin. You have all the big stuff. I see you collect mainly pop culture shock and sideshow. Mm -hmm. Did you ever try to collect Kotobukiya or you like big pieces? You mm -hmm. wanna, you wanna I used to have small ones, 1A, 1A, but now I have this, I don't, I don't do that no more. There's no room first. Yeah, and yeah. you want to keep it, do you want to keep it like the same kind of yeah. style and stuff yeah. like that? Well, all I can tell you is you have an amazing collection. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, I'm going to show you right now, like, a little bit of his collection, like what's going on, and to tell you about it, and what I think is absolutely amazing. Okay, so check it out. All right, well, let me start. He has the actual uh, the three uh, X Men, and he has also X Men right here. So that's like kind of the X Men line. I love it. He's not missing anything. Uh, he also has right here Colossus and the Lady in Blue. Psylocke. Psylocke. I keep forgetting names today. And also, if we go back to the top, he has Ghost Riders, Daredevil, one st uh, Storm uh, Which one is that? The Storm Trooper. So I'm gonna show you the top first, and the skeleton, awesome. And here, the X Men. He has Cap. He has uh, Widow. These are these are the uh, the movie versions. Yeah. They're awesome. And here he has Lady Death. Do you like Lady Death? Awesome. <laughs> and here we have Vampirella. We have Cap and Red Skull. And here we have Doom. Great display for Doom. And here we have Thanos and Lady Death. The Beast, half a scale. Here ARH. Spider Man. Wow, this actually looks amazing, Ryan. Um, I haven't seen him on. I haven't seen it in person. This is my first time seeing it in person. It's absolutely amazing. Yeah. Do you, uh, do you like this one or the Spider Man Comic Cat more? The Comic Cat. You course. like the Comic Cat yeah. more? Okay. So here we go down to the AH line. Here we are. He has four. Is that the exclusive or the regular? The regular. The regular. Great line, and. Uh, he has a Joker Premium format, the first of the DC, Lionel, Street Fighter line, Darth Talon, and finally, Street Fighter right here. But the favorite of your collection, you said, is this bad boy right here. This is the first one that he actually bought, but he has all the exclusive. And this line right there, like just these four, will cost you probably like 2400 And I see you have Medusa. Do you love Medusa? I mean, oh. this is a massive piece. The best from the Irish. Yeah, it's beautiful, beautiful. And also, he has right here, Hot Toy. He has a Hot Toy. Beautiful, and he has the Hulk. That thing is massive, huh? Yep. Do you like it, or you're or disappointed that it doesn't weigh as much as it's supposed to? Yeah, maybe 10 pounds heavier. It would have been better? Yeah. And here, what I love, he has the whole line of Spider-Man. All the villain and Spider-Man as well. Love it. And he has a grail, a grail right here. Hawk. I'm chasing that one too. I'm going to get one of those. If you want to sell me this one, you know, we can trade something. I'll give you something for it. I'll let you know. <laughs> I like this more than the um, maquette. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And here also, he has... Dark Child from from Pop Culture Shock, Vampirella, and Scorpion. Great, great, great line. Literally a hundred pieces, if not more, in this room. I stopped counting on a hundred. 
Alright, let's get back to Ryan. Since he liked both these tattoos the most, so we're gonna end the video next to these two tattoos. So all I can say is thank you Ryan for letting us do this review in this beautiful room. I mean, I can't wait to see what you're gonna do next. Maybe you'll put shelves on top. I mean, you have a high ceiling, so you can always put shelves on top and make it bigger. It's, it's literally a museum. You're lucky to have these many statues and you know what? I know I can come to your house to see if I want to buy a statue or not. This is the guy that I want to come to in case he, I want to decide to buy something. I just saw the Wolf Predator and whoever has it is very lucky. It's a beast and super detailed, great paint job. You know, I want to congrats all my friends that got it. I want to congrats you that you got it. I know you had certain problems at the beginning with Sideshow, but now they send you a perfect one, so it's, it's really, really nice. That's like a great purchase. Again, guys, thank you for watching. Thank you, Ryan. And hopefully, I'll get to your house and make more statue collection reviews. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Ryan, what is this mess? Pretty bad. Look, 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 look. Is this where you spend all your time? Not really. I have baby, so... But the reason why I brought you guys here because he has an amazing anime collection. Look at this. Look, look, look. Look at this. These are so cool. Am I waking up your baby? No, don't okay. worry. Because <laughs> I, I am very loud. Look at this. this these are so awesome. Uh, how come you, uh, I mean, are you going to stop collecting these or what? Or why do you collect these, to, to be honest? Like, are you an anime fan too? Yeah, I am. I used to watch a lot of Japanese anime, so that's why. That's why it's hard. And I see these are custom made, huh? Yeah. Very tough. Did you make them yourself? or you? No, never. But you, you have friends that actually, oh, you have the Street Fighter lines. Yeah. Ryu, Akuma, Saka. I'm pretty sure a lot of people will buy Akuma. <laughs> These are great collections. This is like behind the scene of Ryan. So cool. Now I have we have one more. He's gonna show us where he puts all his boxes. Oh. We're gonna embarrass him to the maximum. <laughs> Bye. Yeah, yeah, you have the talking balls. Okay. <laughs> a lot of bit of that. <sighs> That's how you feel when you look at this, huh? Man, shit. I need, I need a space, man. You guys, he doesn't know he's being recorded. <laughs> look at this. This is what happens when you have a hundred statue. Oh. You have a car and you have boxes. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? You have... Oh my god. You even have hot toys that you, even, you don't yeah. even have on display. Okay, guys, that's what happened. When you need a... When you want to have a hundred statue, you need a garage that big. And make that much space for it. God damn. You know, never divorce your wife. No. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, guys. Thank you.